It's been amazing. It's been amazing to see the outpour of love. Rabbi Beryl Slavatiki says the last few weeks have been anything but easy as the Israel-Hamas war rages on. But seeing so many different people coming together, donating supplies to those families impacted, is the exact kind of hope his community needs. People from all over New Hampshire, despite what their beliefs are and what the political view, everyone is standing together because people understand that this is a time that is facing good versus evil. Everybody here knows somebody that knows someone that is affected directly by what's going on. Things like batteries, backpacks, dark colored clothing and medical kits all accepted at the drive since Wednesday. The center working with organizations like Israel Heart to Heart and a network of local rabbis ensuring donations are put directly in the hands of suffering families. On our lists on our website we constantly update because we get different demands and requests from the from the organizations on the ground and which is a good part that we know exactly where this stuff is going. Items like flat Flashlights, socks, and blankets have been donated in abundance over the last few days. But Rabbi Salvatiki tells me there's still a real need for monetary donations so organizers can continue focusing on buying first aid kits. We might do another drive if we get a larger request of many, you know, many different items that it need. And tonight, these supplies are being shipped to Israel from Logan Airport. But the center's donation page is still up and running for those looking to contribute. They need this support, they need financial support, and they need the main Think people should know that people are standing together, united. In Newington, Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.